Hello everybody and welcome to my August 2021 booktube shout out. Dane reads. Goodness knows when you'll actually be seeing this. At the time of filming I'm currently editing my May shout outs so we've got a bit of a backlog although that is the last backdated video so I've almost caught up with everything but then I also have videos scheduled for release like every day for a while so um We'll see how that goes. Anyway, I've got 10 channels to uh, shout out here. For what I did for this, I just went in and looked at my comments and picked out 10 channels that had recently commented on my videos. It's the same method I use for tagging people. So without further ado, let's go. So at number one, we have Charles Heathcote, the inimitable Charlie. Charlie is a British booktuber. He works in a charity shop and does some vlogs, which I always find interesting when he takes us behind the scenes there. Um, I feel like we used to read a lot more similarly than we do now, although he has recently read some uh, Terry Pratchett, so that was cool. But um, regardless, we got on well. I edited his novel, in fact, um, so An Heir to Murder. He's got a bunch of books out. Uh, go and check out his channel, he's great. Then we have The Bookish Report, Alex. So uh, he mostly does gaslight horror, uh, although he does a bit of uh, other stuff here and there. He, he's uh, picking up I Am Legend soon by Richard Matheson, which is a cracking book. So go and check out his channel to see what he made out of that. And uh, yeah, overall great guy. He's also currently growing his moustache, so he can actually like bend it up now, which is great. He's got his beard and his moustache. He's looking cracking. It's looking very steampunk. All right, then we have Lost in My Library. Uh, this is a channel I don't know too much about, I'm afraid, so sorry about that, but uh, as I say, I wanted to try and make it a bit more democratic and give back to the community that gives so much to my channel. So uh, even if it's a YouTuber that I haven't watched much of, I wanted to give them a shout out, and I have gone and subscribed to them, and you should go and do the same. Then we have Jeremy Fee, cracking booktuber. Um, we always have a little bit of a, a chat because we read, I think, more similarly than I do with most other booktubers anyway. So if you like the kind of stuff I like, you'll probably like their channel. Um, just a very sort of approachable booktuber as well. Great mix of content, great channel, recommended. Then we have Mary Ann Moronsky. So actually at the time of filming, uh, she hasn't done any uploads for a while, although I think she's thinking about coming back. I know she's also a blogger as well, but what's cool about Mary Ann is that she was um, a, like a community member first and foremost. So I kind of first got to know her because she was commenting on my videos and stuff, and we were always encouraging her to go ahead and join the community. She did so, and now I think uh, we as booktubers owe it to her to go and check her out and to show her some support and some love. Then we have Big Hard Books and Classics. This is Al. He also has a second channel, which I can't remember what it's called now, but it's for his like heart playing and music. Uh, he's a cracking little musician. Very interesting guy as well. He seems like he's lived quite an interesting life. And uh, yeah, as the sort of channel name suggests, he does these uh, big hard books and classics quite often. But also, he's you know he just reads a bit of everything. He's uh, got a very inquisitive mind. Then we have Monster Blood, who um, we chat a lot about uh, Goosebumps because I'm slowly but surely finishing my way through Goosebumps. Monster Blood was actually one of the Goosebumps um, uh, books in the series as well. And uh, just always a pleasure to chat with those. If you like Goosebumps, check out Monster Blood. Then we have Booktube Goddess, who is one of the best drag queens on Booktube, as there are more than one, and I don't want to throw any shade because. So, well, I know two drag treat queen channels and they're both great. Um, but yeah, Booktube Goddess also does this great series of her reacting to popular booktubers. She did Mara from Books Like Woe recently. I definitely recommend you check that out, especially if you like Mara. Then we have Mindy's Book Journey, although I think she's recently changed her channel name, so I'll put the new channel name below if she has. I feel like she has, uh, like after I prepped this, but before I filmed it, you know. But uh, Mindy reads a fair amount of horror. Uh, does a lot of um, readathons as well, so if you're looking for channels that participate in readathons so that you yourself can take part in some, I would definitely recommend checking out Mindy. And then we have Attention with an exclamation mark, and he's one of the most uh, creative booktubers I know really, especially with tags. Uh, he finds really interesting ways to take tags and like often has like conversations with himself uh, and all this kind of stuff. Just a very, uh, very great booktuber. He's done some poetry here and there and he's a musician too, so cool guy. So there we have it, those are 10 booktube channels that I recommend for the month of August 2021. As always, don't forget to check out below. In the description I'll have links to all of these channels so you can go through, check out their videos and subscribe to them if you'd like. Always, of course, subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my videos. Hit that like button if this has helped. Let me know in the comments whose uh, booktube channels you've been enjoying recently. And I will see you soon for another bookish video. Uh, uh. And I will see you soon for another bookish video. Thanks a lot. Bye bye.